Hey guys, Brian from PFC here, and I'm uh, fortunate enough to be joined by Chris Dowdy, who's our Director of Training for our Asia Pacific Division, and also by Tony Newman, who's our Director of Operations in Asia Pacific. And uh, for those of you that have never met them, they're two fantastic guys. Those of you that are down in that sector of the world, you ever get an opportunity to do any training or, or operations with them, they're two really, really sound guys. But uh, today what I want to actually talk about is we're always hammering on the range and talking about the importance of dry practice and just how crucial that is. We tell guys over here stateside, get that blue gun, train with that blue gun as much as possible. But the proof is really in the pudding between these two fellows right here who've got some unique challenges and obstacles uh, due to where they live. And if you've uh, ever seen them run a gun, they're just as good as any of the rest of the PFC cadre. And I'd, uh, I'd just be curious, Tony, if you can just comment on how you tend to, to maintain your skill level with the, the schedule you maintain and, and everything along those lines. By using a blue gun, Brian, two to three days a week, I'll get on the blue gun at home, in the office. Um, I'm working it as much as possible, practicing the manipulations, practicing stances, practicing holds, and that's one of the ways I keep my skills up. Good. Chris, anything to try on yeah, uh, Very similar. I generally work uh, for about 20 minutes a day. Most days uh, I'll run everything from transitions to uh, entering rooms on my own or a partner if I've got Tony around. Uh, I work through presentations, after action drills, everything. And basically it allows me to keep my muscle memory going. And as Tony said, we go through our manipulations and it tends to translate into good results when we're actually on the range. One more thing, uh, Chris, I want to mention, I, I keep one of these weapons in a high visibility place in the office, and uh, every chance I get, I pick it up, I run practice manipulations, uh, and practice running it all the time, and just, it drives my wife nuts. So guys, there you have it, I can't say enough about the importance of that dry manipulation and good, solid, sound practice that's making uh, truly perfect repetitions. Stay safe.